Welcome back to Spill the Tea with Dominique Hagler. I am your host, Dominique Hagler, of course. And now I will be interviewing the beautiful and powerful Miss Sparky D. So, Miss Sparky, can you tell me a little bit about you? First, I want to say thank you, Dominique, for having me. Oh, wow. Um, Sparky D, born and raised in Brownsville, Brooklyn. White mother, black father. I took it to the hood. You know, hip hop, they were playing music in the park. And I was a little girl, and I just got on the microphone, and the rest was history. Nice. And I know that you're into, like, the whole gospel, and you write books. So tell me a little bit about that. Well, my book is called From the Pit to the Palace. That's one of them, and it is on Amazon. That's about the story of my life, 17 years of crack cocaine, prostitution, domestic violence, and homelessness. Uh, my new book will be coming out uh, November 2nd. It's a daily devotion book, God Got Your Back Like a Jacket and just doing the will of God, just doing what God will have me to do. Nice, so what's your, what is the inspiration behind the things that you do? Like what keeps you going every single day? God, you know, he delivered, like I said, you know, my testimony, he delivered me for so many things out of the wilderness. So I gotta keep pressing and keep pushing. He gave me a ministry called Treasure Ministries. It's my pleasure to find your treasure with inside yourself. It's just pushing you where you need to be, Dominique. I'm in the schools on a daily basis. Just got my curriculum in Fayette County schools. Woo, now I'm talking about Fayette County in Atlanta, <laughs> y'all. And if y'all don't know about Fayette County, you got to ask somebody. So I just do what God will have me to do, Dominique. Um, the movie is coming out. It's supposed to be coming out December 1st. Roxanne, Roxanne. So God is just doing great things in my life. That is beautiful. That is beautiful. So what would be some advice that you would give the women, and I'm going to also say the men too, that's going through things, that's just trying to make their way out, trying to find out where to go. What, what would be the advice that you would give them? Always remember. You could do all things through Christ Jesus. Write every dream you can, write every vision you can, because you know you can do all things through Christ. But I just want to say something to the folks that's saying, well, it, 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 she's talking like it's easy. No, it's not easy. Take one day at a time. If your addiction is alcohol, you walk to the uh, liquor store saying, I plead the blood of Jesus. If your addiction is crack, walk to the crack house, I plead the blood of Jesus. See, because God knows your heart. You know, and, and for the little girls, keep your clothes on. Don't sell yourself. Keep your clothes on. God gave us all gifts, and all of you have a gift inside of you. So keep pressing and keep pushing and pray. And I tell you, for the young kids, if you got your sneakers, your Jordans, your best favorite pair of sneakers, throw them under the bed. Because guess what, Dominique? They got to kneel down to get their sneakers. Prayer changes things. That is beautiful. I told y'all she was good. She is great. She is amazing. I like that. <laughs> well, thank you, Miss Sparky D. I appreciate you so much. And you sound like you have such a beautiful spirit and a beautiful heart. And I could just feel you. I feel you. I do. And I thank you. I appreciate you for being here. Thank you so much for having me. Thank you.